Ghana's unemployment rate shot up from 12.2% in 2019 to 19.7% in 2020. However, the figures according to the Ministry of Employment and Labor Relations does not include that of unemployed persons with disability. Although some 3% was recorded by the Statistical Service in 2010, it does not reflect the total unemployment rate among persons with disability. To address this challenge, the Ministry of Employment and Labor Relations has begun engaging persons with disability to solicit views on how the ministry can collate accurate data. And as Berku is a project coordinator with the Ministry of Employment and Labor Relations. The Ghana Labor Market Information System is envisaged to be a one-stop shop platform for all labor market data or information that would enable stakeholders like you take evidence-based uh, decisions such as which skills you would need to develop in order to facilitate your employment in the in, in industry and which uh, sectors are more rewarding among others. The public employment centers would be in the district for job counseling and employment promotion purposes. The president of the Center for Employment with Persons with Disability, Alessandra Kujotete, expressed concern about the marginalization of persons with disability. If the youth age limit is cut over at 35, um, for persons with disabilities, we can make it like 45. Because for me, I, I am 53, but I, I, I look strong, I can work. So if you cut me off and say <laughs> age 40, you are cut off, you are cutting me off because probably I completed my education when I was at age uh, 35. Mm. Okay, so I, I still have more years to work and be able to take care of my family.